Welcome back here to Live Now from Fox. We just got this shot up of the podium there from the Orange County Sheriff's Office as we await Sheriff John Mina to update us on this shooting investigation. Multiple people shot in this neighborhood there in the Pine Hills section of Orlando. Joining us now is Fox 35 Orlando reporter Dave Puglisi. He's at the scene with more. Uh, Dave, thanks so much for being with us. Uh, what exactly happened? What do we know? Right now we're hearing that it was actually a local news crew that was involved in this shooting. Down the street, it's a little bit hard to see now, but you can still see some flashing lights off in the distance. But down there, we could see at least two news cars down down along uh, Hialeah Street here. Now, earlier today here on Hialeah, there was a shooting where a 20-year-old was killed. Now, what witnesses have told me, then a few hours later, they heard some shots around 4 o'clock. Again, we're hearing that a local news crew was involved in this. Deputies do say they have a suspect in custody, and in just about five minutes, they will be updating us on what exactly happened here. But that is the latest that we know here on uh, in Hialeah Street in Orlando. Dave Puglisi, back to you. Okay, Dave, we uh, have another shot of this scene as well. It looks to be very, very active. Um, but this is horrible. They were... That news crew presumably was covering this. They were responding to the scene. They were getting the information out, and they were impacted by this. And, and you know, how far are you from the scene? How far is police keeping you? Because obviously, this is dangerous now. Yeah, pretty much. Police have the whole street blocked off. Uh, you're. You can only get close by going through some side streets, which is where we're on right now. Uh, there's at least multiple sets of police officers as you go down the road here. Now, where the, those flashing lights are off in the distance, where we could see two news cars, that is where the earlier shooting from this morning had happened. Um, so we're still trying to find out a little bit more information on what was going on here at the time. But again, in just a few minutes, the sheriff's office will be updating us on exactly what happened here. All right, Dave Puglisi there live on the scene. Dave, thanks so much. Talk again. All right, uh, and in the meantime, we do want to just show you the aerial scene from earlier as well. Take a look at this. Uh, this was, uh, you know, before obviously nighttime when the sun was still up. You could see there from above the yellow police tape in a pretty large perimeter there, a lot of law enforcement responding. Uh, that was from about, oh, now an hour and a half ago. We're still waiting, of course, for this press conference to begin there from Orange County Sheriff's officials. We have this live look and you can see there, they're getting the white balance ready. They're getting prepared. But uh, like Dave was saying, this news crew that was involved in this, this is a horrible situation. When you're a news crew and you go out to cover a very, very dangerous scene like this, it doesn't even occur to you that you could possibly be involved in this. And so this is really, really a horrible set of circumstances. And so hopefully we'll get an update possibly on the conditions of these individuals, but also how this all happened. Uh, remember, police were there early this morning responding to a woman in her early 20s who was shot. They have detained a suspect. Hopefully we'll learn a little bit more about who they have in custody as well. Take a look at this tweet from Dave Puglisi from earlier when the sun was still up. He took this photo. Orange County deputies are at the scene of a shooting on Hialeah Street. They say multiple people were shot. Witnesses say a local news crew was involved. A suspect in custody. So I know it's very preliminary at this point in time. We're going to stay with this. Uh, of course, we're getting the uh, update at the top of the hour. We're going to put up some of these scenes here, uh, multiple scenes on the screen for you as we continue to follow this story.